well, we're very happy to have you along because we have a lot of great stories that we want to get to, um, some interesting news, some announcements, and let's just jump right in because the first one actually has to do with our friends over at Amazon. The U.S. Department of Defense relies on modern military applications that are data heavy and depend on low latency to enable critical communications and coordination in the field. You know, all the things that a military would like to do. Accessing, processing, and sharing that data at the tactical edge is becoming more increasingly more essential as we move on. And uh, Amazon has announced an AWS modular data center for the U.S. Department of Defense joint warfighting cloud capability, which you may recall from all of the stories that we uh, did about the demise of the JEDI contract. Well, JWCC is something that has grown out of that. John, is the AWS cloud becoming more and more mobile, like we can finally deploy it all over the world, wherever the uh, soldiers of America are fighting for freedom and all the other things? Tom, I'll tell you what, with the addition of the AWS MDC, and I think there's a miss here because it should be like AWS MC, like hosting a data center. Sorry for the pun, but thinking about that, being able to have a data center wherever you're at and remotely and utilizing the AWS services are very key. So think about it, AWS released Outpost. Now you can have a rack within your data center, AWS local zones, a local AWS infrastructure, relatively low latency closer to your existing data center. Well, on the 13th, AWS announced the availability of AWS modular data center for the US Department of Defense. And it makes it easier for DOD agencies to deploy modular data centers with AWS infrastructure in limited locations. When you say limited locations, you know, getting to the public cloud in these remote locations are very hard to do, even utilizing some of the satellite capabilities that are out there. Having this infrastructure close and available to you is making it key for some of those that are out there in the def defense. Managing it is easy with every unit and expandable. If you haven't seen a picture of it yet, it looks like two shipping containers that are easily expandable depending on where you're at. Now, I'll tell you what, you can proactively monitor these and manage them using any of the management sy systems and capabilities available to you, and you have the option for satellite. I think the AWS MDC is very key for the US Department of Defense, and it allows them to actually connect and go back to uh, GovCloud. This is really cool that they added it. And now they did release it on the 13th, the day before Valentine's Day, and it was during one of the public sector summits.